Cole, uh, Sharon, thank you. The soggy forecast has some people wondering what it means for the final Buck Days events. Action 10 Seth Kobar is live at the Buck Days Carnival tonight. And Seth, it doesn't appear as if the threat of rain is keeping people away tonight. Not exactly. Take a look down the midway. Lots of folks are gathered riding rides, they're waiting in line for food, they're playing games. It's the second and final dollar Thursday here at the Buck Days Carnival. It's just a dollar to get in and a dollar to get on one of those rides. A heck of a deal that hundreds of people couldn't pass up, even with the threat of drenching rain in the forecast. With storm clouds riding into the coastal bend and all of us waiting for the bottom to drop out, the Buck Days Carnival carries on. Word. Trying to get here before all the rain does. <laughs> the word family is willing to risk the rain for the rides and the food. Hopefully, little Maxine and her sweet snack don't melt. What do you want to eat out here, sweetie? Hot and candy. <laughs> the forecast isn't keeping Dallas Ayas and his girlfriend away. We're gonna ride till, so we can't no more. And this crew, well, Mother Nature, cover your ears. Screw the rain. We're gonna have fun anyways. Not everyone shares their enthusiasm. I don't want to get wet. <laughs> but for his granddaughter, he will. Just like this duo. A little wetness can't get hurt. Ah, we live in by the ocean. We're always wet. <laughs> Corpus Christi people always wet. <laughs> wet is one thing. Severe weather is another. Carnival organizers say they're watching closely. <laughs> and if a bad storm spins up, they'll clear the park and get people to safety. Well, they understand that it is what it is with the weather, and, and you just have to, you can't control Mother Nature. Approach all weekend long. Of course, the carnival set to run through Sunday. There is the junior parade set for Saturday. A game time will be decision will be made on that at least tomorrow afternoon. We'll have a better idea if it's going to go on as scheduled. We'll let you know about that. There has been one postponement because of the impending bad weather. Not a Buck Days thing, but a text dot thing. There's going to be a virtual reality exercise at Waterburger Field on Saturday. That has been postponed. No makeup day just yet. Reporting live in Corpus Christi, Seth Kovar, Action 10 News. Good to know. Thanks a lot, Seth. Meanwhile, the